Welcome back to AFAX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Digital content creator Nairofi had something to say to those who feel really invested and having so much opinion when it comes to her personal business. As you know, people have been speculating that her, together with her ex husband, or rather, maybe not ex husband, Bebe aka Euphorian, have been back together. And this rumors actually started when Nairofi was spotted, or rather, started driving her old car, the red car that is. They both have never denied or confirmed if they are back together. This is something that has left their followers or rather fans in a limbo. There were those who are not supportive of her getting back with her ex, which can be seen as well. And there's also a saying, no matter what we are standing with you, Nairofi, we are here to support you. And that is all that matters. So Nairofi takes to her Instagram, shares that she is in Dubai. And she posts this particular photo that you see right now on the screen. And there are those who are still saying, we need an explanation after all that we said on social media of course there were people who took sides we really need to get a clarification then there are a group of followers who really don't want these two to get back together they believe that this is toxic and they hope that it is not true so anyway that photo Nero shares it on her timeline and then Bebe aka Euphorian comments there as you can see there is nothing much of course the emojis but you can clearly tell these are two people goofing around and so you can see the comments Wambea Oye somebody actually tagged the team as himself and Gobare somebody says Wa Kenya Mutakoma I take back any bad comment I left for you Che besides Dan aka Euphorian commenting on Nairofi's profile they have been following each other that is also something that indicated that these two people are in good terms as you can see somebody else said here we cried with you we subscribed like crazy if anything girl we need explanation and you can see the shocking emoji there somebody says mambo zawatua wili musiwai ingililia ona sasa kina turamba somebody says nimechoka kukutetea sasa and this just shows you how some people are really invested in Nairobi's personal life and even her marriage and they are feeling so bad if these two have gotten back together Someone says, Ulisema Uchaguzi Irudiwe Tena. You can see the laughing emojis there. Mambo ya watu wawili vitovu zao zimekutana wachana nayo. And someone says, Musha Rudiana, they left the clearly in love emoji. This is somebody who seems to be supportive of this. Somebody says, Love wins. Wishing you well, Nairofi. And someone says, I'm happy for you, Nairofi. Me, I will always support you and Bambi no matter what. Before we get to what she shared, I don't know what you guys think. Um, when Nairofi and uh, uh, baby broke up or rather when they started their online jabs at each other it was very vile and we all saw how you know they called each other names things that you would not expect from people who are really in love and post that drama Nerofi really seemed to have been traumatized by that entire thing and the people who are really feeling bad for her and they really wanted her to thrive they were supporting her so you can see how some people are really into their feelings when it comes to if she has gotten back with her ex and sometimes people break up and they find their way back to each other but i think this makes it a bit difficult even to open up to your followers considering the fact that they're already some are very judgmental the criticism that might come with it the judgment the backlash because you can see the little innuendos on her comments maybe sometimes it's just best to take the silent route and not respond but you can see from some of the comments people are saying we need some clarification no offense to couple channels it seems like it has so much pressure because even when things are not okay you are forced to give an explanation to the public because you already let them into a personal space i mean it must be a very difficult battle when it comes to people feeling entitled and they want answers to your personal life anyway so Nairofi shares this particular post we don't get to see the entire conversation but it's like a screenshot of a photo and it's written in post gani leo and she captions this advice to our dearest viewers don't be too invested in someone's instagram we know exactly what we are doing and your reaction is exactly what we wanted and expected before typing a paragraph remember that and save yourself 
the zero work now this comes after the post that she had posted and the comments that people were leaving we have gone through a few of those it's not clear if this is a direct response to those comments and the fact that she's also stating that most of these posts are pre-planned which many creators do even photos that they post doesn't mean that it is in real time so she's putting out that people need to stop being too invested in someone's instagram she also shares namutulie premium content loading this month do you think that the same way they let their followers into their drama and when they broke up should they also let them know when they have gotten back together and if they haven't should they clarify and make it clear stop the assumptions we are no longer together but we have decided to move forward as friends and hence they squash all these rumors and people leave them alone or perhaps they can just decide to take the silent route and people decide Decide to just assume what they think is happening in their lives anyway that's what's happening on the internet street you are up to date thanks so much for watching subscribe hit the notification bell so be the first to be notified once of any new uploads i will catch you on the next one bye bye